Yo, 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 yo. What's good, y'all, man? We got Ant Man and Watts Quantum Mania teaser trailer release update. Man, we got another update on the teaser trailer. They said it's supposed to come out. I don't know when. You know rumors though. You know me. You know me. I don't. You know what I'm saying. I don't believe in rumors though. I don't. I don't believe in rumors. You feel me? I don't. So hey, but hey, I heard on the on the side it supposed to come out like around like in the fall area like this month or like I don't know though. I don't know. So we gonna see the update, man. We are gonna see what's going on in that. You know what I mean? In that field. But yeah, I don't listen to rumors though. I hear the rumors, but I don't. I don't believe in them. You know what I mean? To it, you know, actually happen. But, um, yeah, like it up, sub, and, um, yeah, let's, let's check the update. Let's go ahead and check the update, y'all. Marvel fans out there, let me know you excited for the Ant-Man and the Wops. Let me know in the comment below. But, um, yeah, let's get What's going on, guys? Welcome to Everything Always. My name is Michael Roman, a.k.a. Offers, with the return to in-person presentations this summer by Marvel Studios, both at San Diego Comic-Con and D23. They also return to the practice of showing exclusive clips and trailers to only those in the audience in attendance and not to the greater public at holes. Yeah. Even though everybody saw it, because you know what I'm saying, like I said, everybody know that if they don't show it to us, guess what? It's going to get linked out. Which it did, you know what I mean? And you can just type it up, and man, was Taser Trail is gonna pop up. Cause you know what I'm saying? It was linked out when they dropped on, you know, D23 or whatever that other convention was type shit. So yeah. But it ain't the, ain't the clear version though. But yeah, it got linked out. But I, don't, I hope they do a different trailer. I ain't see it though. I saw like a little bit of it. But I ain't really see it. But um, yeah, I hope they, I hope they do another, uh, another clips and shit. You know what I mean? But, I mean, people can watch it regardless because it's the HD version. You feel me, man? But, yeah, if you want to look it up, the trailer is, yeah, just type it up. It's on YouTube. Somewhere on YouTube. Yeah. <laughs> they normally do on their YouTube channel. And while, of course, that upsets some fans, but there's a reason for this, and we'll talk about it during this video. The director on Ant-Man and the Wasp Quantumania, one of the trailers that was shown at both presentations, said, sit tight, more coming about that film this fall, which we all took to mean, and in an update 13 days ago we covered here at the channel, it was probably going to be attached to the Black Panther release, as that's the last theatrical release before Ant-Man and the Wasp comes out just... And that's why I said, too, you say do that shit. They did it with, um, did they do it with, um, the other movie came out before Black, I don't know, I said Black Adam, I'm about to say Black Adam. Um, before Black Panther, um, what that was, Thor, right? I think they did, with, nah, they didn't do it with Thor. They didn't do it with Thor, though. But they did, like, I think, I said a couple weeks after Thor, or a couple months after Thor, some shit. But yeah. Yeah. Just three months later. Um, well, we have an update today coming from an industry insider and fellow YouTuber also filling us in on when we can expect to see the holiday special trailer as well for the upcoming Guardians of the Galaxy holiday special. We're breaking it down, both trailers and when they're going to be released for Marvel Studios. But first, if you could grab the subscribe button, quick reminder, we do Marvel content at the channel. That's all we do. Everything from official Easter egg breakdowns, trailers and reviews to the occasional industry insider scoop like we're covering today and everything in between. So if that sort of thing's for you, hit the subscribe button, leave a comment down below. That will automatically enter you to win our ongoing PS5 giveaway. If you want, stick around to the end of the video. We'll get into all the giveaway stuff again there. So it was 13 days ago we last updated you guys on the Quantumania trailer. Now a fellow YouTuber and somewhat of an industry insider herself is following up with a confirmation. She reported today, Grace Randolph, quote, I hear Quantumania trailers coming out with Black Panther Wakanda forever. She's now the third. It's my hair, y'all. My hair growing, y'all. My hair growing. <laughs> Wait, what? Shrag? And off, quote, I hear Quantumania trailers coming out with Black Panther Wakanda forever. She's now the third industry insider to indicate such, which means we're literally less than two weeks mm -hmm. away. She goes on to say, we'll be getting the hashtag Guardians of the Galaxy holiday special trailer soon as well. Which Yeah, I heard about that. Yeah, they supposed to come out with that shit too. Yeah. Which is awesome news because we haven't seen you know. that trailer at all in any shape or form in either of the presentations this year. James Gunn was in attendance for the same. Yeah, I was saying that we, we heard about it. We saw pictures, but it been quiet. Though. That's why I, said, I thought that shit gonna, you know what I mean, not gonna happen, but it apparently, I mean, shit, I don't know, it's still happening. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> it's still happening and shit, but apparently, you know what I'm saying? Apparently, it's still happening. 
Diego Comic-Con presentation did show the Guardians of the Galaxy 3 trailer, but nothing to do with the holiday special that we anticipate would have had to have kicked up promo pretty soon because it's only coming about a month after Black Panther Wakanda Forever. Now, if you're wondering about the Ant-Man and the Wasp Quantumania trailer, they did show it again at both presentations and it has been broken down in full every detail on multiple YouTube channels, including mine. I'll make sure to link it at the end of this, but they were slightly different, slightly variations, and this sort of plays into why they don't release these to the public. Number one, in a lot of cases, their editing is not done both on the film. Hey, I about to say the same thing. The edits, the VFX, it's not there. You might, you, you might fuck around and see goddamn green screen in the motherfucker, even though you're supposed to see the actual movie. Yeah, it's a lot of shit. You know what I mean? So, hey, that's why, hey, you know, hey, that's what we're going to see. You see what I'm saying? Do you want Marvel? You know what I'm saying? They already got a lot of people talking about Marvels. Not me, though, but you know, other people, they all got to hate Marvel for, you know, some reason. Some some reason. I don't know. But yeah, you want people to be, oh, shit, the green screen. You, nah, Marvel don't want that shit. Films <laughs> in the trailers, the VFX may not be completely there. And that's exactly what James Gunn said in a tweet about why they didn't show the Guardians of the Galaxy 3 trailer. The VFX are not done. But also, Marvel Studios has always done their marketing this way. They have, even when they had less projects to work with, always strive to give each property its own shine, make sure we weren't already looking too far ahead. One thing I will say, though, there's sort of blueprint as of late. I wouldn't be surprised if we didn't have both of these trailers and drop on the exact same day they've done that actually a lot real recently one or two trailers werewolf by night and secret invasion on the same day the same thing during san diego Con Oh yeah, now they, they, they did have a lot of trailers. They, they did. Yeah. So be looking for both of these and right around the corner. Yes, this is the trailer that involves brand new shots of King and the scene of him discussing killing Ant-Man as an Avenger. We're going to break it all down again when it finally comes out. In the meantime, if you want to see my full breakdown of that trailer, I was in person at D23, have all of the dialogue in tow. I'll link it at the end of this quickly. Let's jump into the giveaway stuff before I let you go. We are still giving away. Yeah, but hey, yeah, but they've they, but they been doing that shit for like for, for a minute in Marvel. They always wait. Now wait, they always give us one trailer. So they want, you know, like you said, it won't be ahead, you know. So they'll do that. But shows that, I mean, it's a little different. They, I think they give us like, I don't know. I think same thing as the movies too, but I know D23, they give us a lot of trailers because, you know, they give us an update, like Secret Invasion and all the other shit. So, but yeah, but hey, man, like it up, man. Let me know. Marvel fans out there, let me know. Cause I know y'all like these content. Marvel fans out there, let me know what y'all think about Ant Man Watts coming soon. You feel me? It's going to come after Black Panther, or it's going to come a couple weeks. At the Black Panther, or a couple months, you know. Well, not a couple months, but you know what I'm trying to say. But yeah, let me know. They say this fall. Hey, it's rumors though, right? It's rumors. You know what I mean? You know, you know us. We don't believe we listen to rumors like that. So let me know in the comment below, baby. Like it up, sub. And I'm yeah, I, peace.